My name is Greta Thunberg, and I want you to panic. This Swedish teenager is being credited with igniting a climate revolution. First off, let's take a look at her credentials. Greta Thunberg first heard about climate change when she was just eight years old. Soon, she'd convinced her family to go vegan and to give up flying. She says that that gave her hope that she could make a difference. Greta's Friday for Future protests began in August 2018, when she sat outside the Swedish parliament on her own every Friday. She'd been inspired by the March for Our Lives protests, where American students led an historic march for gun control. Many of you appear concerned that we are wasting valuable lesson time but I assure you, we will go back to school the moment you start listening to the science. Friday for Future is now a global movement involving hundreds of thousands of people taking to the streets. What do we want? What do we want? What do we want it now? Greta has laid into some of the world's most powerful people. You lied to us. You gave us false hope. And she practices what she preaches. Greta has traveled a great distance on a train from Sweden. But she says she's just a normal girl who misses her sister and her dogs. And she didn't start the climate revolution. She arrived at a time when it was looking for a hero. There have been climate activists for decades, but something has changed. Young protesters are getting more and more attention. Here's why. First, social media platforms have become activist recruiting grounds. Greta's generation are known for being more socially aware, so they're already primed to get on board. And it has become much easier to be a young climate activist. Sea levels are rising, and so are we. The second reason is their message, and it's a scary one. You told us that the future was something to look forward to. Most children are not even aware of the fate that awaits us. Young activists have tapped into people's fear for their own lives, much more attention-grabbing than how bad climate change will be for the planet. And the third reason is their age. Mother Nature is crying. It's harder to ignore school children than older, more typical protesters. The image of hundreds of thousands of kids coming together is a positive one, and it makes it much easier for everyday people to get behind them. And their queen, she says she's not a leader, icon or face of a movement. I don't want you to listen to me. I want you to listen to the scientists. But that's what makes Greta Thunberg the perfect figurehead. By leading a movement that is now cool among young people, she's become a person people can aspire to be. She's become the climate poster girl.